I'm just saying. All it's saying is that you got a copy of this. Okay. I'm going to put today's date to 12 on there. Bailey's mother, Kimberly, though, told a more plaintive and complicated story about her daughter in two lengthy telephone conversations that were recorded by the Centralia detectives investigating the sale of the lethal fentanyl lace cocaine. As the mother told it, her daughter was an innocent Moscow High graduate who put in a disjointed year at the U of I before hooking up with Robinson, 14 years her senior. A charmer with his cornrows and tough guy menace. And what a tumultuous five-year love story their romance has been. Bailey, her mother said, has allegedly been living in fear of Robinson's violent mood swings and hair-raising threats of what will happen to her family if she ever leaves them. There have been times, in fact, when Kimberly and her ex-husband have rushed to their daughter's rescue after getting a teary distress call. They drive for hours and then covertly ferry her off while Robinson was sleeping the afternoon away. But each time, Bailey would run back to Robinson. Was it love? Was it fear? Bailey's mom worried to the police, as did Emma's friends, who followed her Instagram account, showing her living a high-flying life in hotel suites in Las Vegas and Cancun, that Robinson was prostituting her. And there was more. When the cops dug deeper, when the cops dug deeper, they grew to suspect that the couple were very possibly dealing drugs they'd scored in Seattle to the local colleges of Pullman and Moscow. Be sure to check out my other videos and playlists for more true crime content. And if that's not enough, you can join our Patreon. Don't have a tinfoil hat? It's okay. We'll make you one. It's that easy. See you guys in the next video. See you later. Bye.